China has summoned the European Union's ambassador to protest the bloc's sanctions over claims of human rights abuses in Xinjiang, while Beijing is hit back with economic measures of its own. Wasting no time, China has hit back with punitive measures after Western countries imposed sanctions over Beijing's treatment of Uyghur Muslims in Xinjiang. Beijing has slapped sanctions on 10 Europeans, including lawmakers and diplomats. It's also summoned the EU's ambassador to China. The row began when the EU, Britain and Canada imposed sanctions on Xinjiang officials. The coordinated effort seeks to ramp up pressure on Beijing. The UN and activists say at least one million Muslims are detained in camps in Xinjiang. Chinese authorities are accused of using forced labour and torture. China maintains that the camps provide vocational training and have helped stamp out extremism in the region. The latest escalation in tensions come as China and Russia's foreign ministers meet in Beijing. They've put up a united front against the West. Moscow and Beijing are pushing for a summit of permanent members of the United Nations, warning that international politics is becoming increasingly turbulent.